So y'all ain't gonna say nothing about them people not wanting to talk to Fanny Willis no more. Them people don't even want to question her no more. Baby, she showed her entire black ass on that stand yesterday. Baby, I told y'all, baby, them lashes should have been rolling up to her forehead. You cannot do that, Fanny. Now look what you done did. You just done gave away Donald Trump. You thought them people was gonna let you get him. You gotta be out your mind. Listen, I keep trying to tell y'all she was the fall guy. Now whatever else Donna got to deal with, he ain't gonna have to deal with what's going on in Georgia. I guess what that's gonna do. That's gonna help him win the state of Georgia because now they gonna say, oh, it was so far Oh, she can't be trusted. She can't be doing. How many of her cases are going to go and be looked at now? How many of the whole, you know, Georgia DA or prosecutor? How, how many of those cases going to be looked at now? That is what you call prosecutorial misconduct. Fanny, you need to get your ass up for messing with that lady husband, regardless if they was married or not. You know you weren't supposed to do that. What part of the law was that? Now you around here taking trips with somebody else's husband, and then you rolling your eyes about it when the people asking you about it. Like, you cannot run from those questions. I told y'all she was just like, why I sell slug? But y'all ain't want to hear me now. Y'all know what to do. Get in the comments because baby, they don't even want to talk to Fanny no more. <laughs> well, there you go. What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride chair extraordinaire. Your super duper Uber driver's here, guys. That's right. That's right. Thank you. Thank you. You tried two times. You guys already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a quick favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. Por favor. <laughs> Come on. Let's do this. Hop on in. Buckle in. And let's go. Yeah! Okay, doke, party people, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, thank you for hitting that subscribe button. What are we talking about today, folks? What are we talking about today? Man, you know, I am surprised that Fulton County, Atlanta, Georgia, they they have Fannie Willis as a prosecutor. You know, they... This is the person that's supposed to take down Donald Trump. This person here. What? I posted something about her way before this trial started that she was a mental midget. She's not too bright. She fumbled a couple of bags before. And um, and I was pretty sure that she was going to mess up Young Thug's case. I believe Young Thug is guilty. But I strongly believe that she was going to mess up the case. Then, long and behold, she, uh, she did an unforced error. And started with this uh, love affair with uh, Mr. Wade. The thing a woman can do for him is make him a sandwich. We would have brutal arguments about the fact that I am your equal. I don't need anything from a man. A man is not a plan. A man is a companion. And so there was tension always in our relationship, which is why I would give him his money back. I don't need anybody to foot my bills. The only man who's ever foot my bills completely is my daddy. Now, what man, what self-respectful man will go half on a vacation with anybody? What woman do you know will go on vacation and say, I'll pay you half? Nobody does that. No black woman do that. That's a lie. I'm going to pay you half. Let's go half on half on a vacation. Do anybody believe that? But here she goes. She playing that, you know, I paid him money. I paid his money back. No, you did not. You did not pay a black man no money on a vacation or half of a dinner or half of nothing. You didn't do that. You're lying. You never wrote him a check? Ma'am, I don't have checks. Okay. Um, so you have no proof of any reimbursement for any of these things because it was all cash, right? The testimony of one witness is enough to prove a fact. So my question was, do you have I'm any proof? You? Is that what you're intimating right here? I'm asking if you have any proof that you paid for any of these The proof money. is what I just told you. You have no written proof. Is that correct? I don't have no checkbooks. Girl, I, I'm worth $8 million. Even though I'm making $100,000 on the government check, she's worth $8 million. I don't got no damn checkbook. The hell are you talking about? <laughs> Man, you know, Mr. Wade must be slinging some pipe. That thing is working because you know she's paying him to sleep with her. Come on, look at her now. Come on now. <laughs> For now, Mr. Wade is not a bad looking guy, no homo, but look at this 53-year-old 
frumpy woman here. You have to pay for it. <laughs> now, how bright is Fanny Willis? How bright is Fanny Willis? I know she's an AKA, and you think she's smart, right? Where's Aruba? Fanny, where's Aruba? Where's Belize? What continent is Belize on? She don't know. Let's take a listen. You also said that he was a world traveler and had been on many of the continents. I've been to six. Have you been on any of those continents with him? Um. Besides this one. Uh, where's Belize? What continent is it? I'm not being funny. I don't know. Uh, Let's say with the I've exception the of... Belize with him. I've been to the Bahamas with him. I've been with Aruba with him. Don't embarrass me. I'm not sure what continents those are on. Whatever continents those are, that's where I've been. I'm sure if I gave it some thought, I would tell you. But whatever continents those are that I've been to those locations. So. But not Australia or any other continents. I don't even want to go to Australia. Australia? Hell no. Nah. I don't want to go to Australia. That shit's too white for me. <laughs> Unbelievable. The attorney also asked the judge, can they treat her like a hostile witness? And just like every Democrat, when you put them in this kind of position, they always use this democracy. Democracy. Let's go. Judges, we haven't gotten to the point where Ms. Willis should be treated hostile. I, I think we have. I very much want to be here, so I'm not a hostile witness. I very much want to be here. not so much that you're hostile, Ms. Willis. It'd be an adverse witness. Your interests are opposed to Ms. Merchant's. Thank you. Ms. Merchant's interests are purchased. Uh, Contrib contrary to democracy, Your Honor, not to mine. Democracy. Contrary to democracy. You see how it works? You see how it doesn't work? <laughs> <laughs> now, we all know that Fanny is not the brightest tool in the shed, right? But Nathan, this guy here, whew, they ask him, have she ever gave you money on a trip before? And he says this. She did. And where did you deposit the money she reimbursed you? Oh, it was cash. She didn't She didn't give me any checks. So she paid you cash for her share of all these vacations? Mr. Schaefer, you'll step out if you do that again. Yes, ma'am. Okay. And so all of the vacations that she took, she paid you cash for? Yes, ma'am. And you purchased all of these vacations on your business credit card, correct? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And you included those in deductions on your taxes, correct? No, ma'am. No, you did not. No, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> so now we got tax fraud on top of all this. Damn it, Nathan. You know, Nathan, if you had just said me too, you would have got away with it. She was your boss. She was paying you for some D. All you had to say was me too. That reminds me of a commissioner in Atlanta, a female commissioner. She was um, having an affair with a married man. And when he said enough, he doesn't want to do it anymore. She fires him. What? Yep. Fires him. And guess what? Fulton County had to pay the guy almost a million dollars for sexual assault or sexual discrimination. Right? But she still have a job, though. Nathan Wade, you should have just saved your own hide and throw Fanny under the bus. And just said, me too. All right? But you're a Southern gentleman. You wouldn't do no such thing like that. Her, on the other hand, if the tables will turn, you know she would have threw you under the bus. As you know, Mr. Wade is a Southern gentleman. Me, not so much. Okay. <laughs> I am so glad that this trial happened. Because black men been saying this about black women forever. You know? But we didn't have a platform. There was no YouTube 20, 30 years ago. The only media that was out there was always putting a microphone, a microphone in front of a woman's face, a black woman's face. The Oprah's of the world, mm. the Donahue's of the world, the Sally Jesse Raphael of the world, cops, whoever would listen to a black woman, they put a microphone in their face and they just Blech. blurt us out, put us out there. We ain't shit. We deadbeats. We don't know how to hold a job. The list goes on. And now, 20, 30 years later, a whole generation later, they getting bigger, bolder, rambunctious, boisterous. They're just loud as f And we cannot reel this back. It's out there. And, you know, she was married before, right? Went right after college. She went to Emory for her JD. 
and she graduated from Emory and married a bum. Now, I just say that because he doesn't have a career. He was a part-time videographer. And so he was a stay-at-home dad. She dropped some babies. He was a stay-at-home dad, raised the kids till it was four or five years old, and then she cuts it. Then she went out and say, I'm a strong black woman. I raised my kids on my own, and blah, 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 blah. The same story. The same story. That is correct. And I think in one of your motions, you tried to implicate I slept with him at that conference, which I find to be extremely offensive. These people are frauds. These people are fakes and phonies. These are the same people that will drive a $120,000 Range Rover and don't have a dollar in their bank account. It's off a show. And these are the same people that's supposed to take Trump down. No! The Democrats bank on these two people to take down Trump. What a world that we in. Well, that's my thought for the day. If you guys got any value out of my content, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. See that notification bell? Turn on that notification bell. So you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends. And tell your mama I said hi. All right, all right. Till next time, guys, I'll see you again. And all you lawyers, get off my lawn.